Today, we are closing the market for military-grade assault weapons in Canada. We are banning 1,500 models and variants of these firearms by way of regulations. These weapons were designed for one purpose and one purpose only, to kill the largest number of people in the shortest amount of time. There is no use and no place for such weapons in Canada. For many families, including many Indigenous people, firearms are part of traditions passed down through generations, and the vast majority of gun owners use them safely, responsibly, and in accordance with the law, whether it be for work, sport shooting, for collecting, or for hunting. But you don't need an AR-15 to bring down a deer. So, effective immediately, it is no longer permitted to buy, sell, transport, import, or use military-grade assault weapons in this country. To protect law-abiding gun owners from criminal liability until they can take steps to comply with this new law, there will be a two-year amnesty period and we will legislate fair compensation. We've heard many people express concern about the militarization of our police. And this is a direct consequence of the militarization of society. And Canadians deserve to live in a society where they can be safe and secure. And people from coast to coast have been clear. We cannot risk another shooting at a school or a place of worship or another attack on police officers or on women or on innocent Canadians anywhere in this country. Banning assault-style firearms will save Canadian lives.